Most people know North Dakota tops the rankings when it comes to oil production, but you may not know that our state is the number one honey producer in the nation. This year's drought could negatively impact the state's honey production, and reporter Maddie Beer Temple spoke to one beekeeper about the industry and how the season could be affected. Good girls. Woo, that's heavy. <laughs> I like that. Rocco Byron takes care of his 24 beehives in Sterling. His two dozen hives are just a small chunk of the roughly 720,000 registered in the state. It's his first year working with the pollinators in the U.S. Before that, Byron learned from a commercial beekeeper while in boarding school in South Africa. I had a dream of coming to the States to come and do commercial beekeeping, but the ultimate dream was to do my own beekeeping. So I'm small now with 24 hives, but I'll get there. Once a week, Byron checks out the hives. It's prime. Each one buzzing with about 60,000 bees that work all summer to make honey. June and July is prime honey season here in North Dakota. It'll be harvested in August, and the bees will be sent to California by October. But this year's drought has caused some concern for Byron and his fellow beekeepers. The guys have had to feed a lot more corn syrup this year. I'm hearing quite a lot about that. Some of the guys are bringing in their bees later. They're keeping the bees in California for longer. Um, they're feeding them down there. He says the mood among others in the field is mixed. Some guys are worried. Some guys are like, ah, we'll make honey. I'm like, yeah, I hope so. <laughs> kind of got to make the money back so somehow. Each of his 24 hives is expected to produce about 50 pounds of honey. After that, Byron hopes to sell his product locally at farmers markets or through Facebook. That is, if the harvest this year pans out. We medicate you, we, we look after you. I mean, just give us some red money back. Just make us some honey somehow. Byron says depending on how this year goes, he hopes to get more hives next season. In Sterling for KX News, Maddie Beer Temple. In 2020, North Dakota bees produced 38.6 million pounds of honey valued at over $61 million, according to the State Department of Agriculture. After the break, how 